Chaitan asks, so um, implementation wise, are they separate? I'm able to achieve separation of concern, but I don't know if I'm doing dependency injection or um, uh, service locator. So um, I think how I would explain this implementation wise is a service locator, no matter how complicated it gets, is just a simple um, class which holds onto some dependencies. So if I um, pull up, I think this one has a locator. So all we're really talking about, a service locator, it's almost bordering on like a, a POJO, a plain old Java object or a plain old Kotlin object. Now you can make them more complicated like in space notes, I had my service locator used um, lazy loading to avoid loading services when I didn't need to. So um, here we have a more complicated, I said provider. Um, I just understand this is a service locator. I, for some reason, I thought the provider was a better name than locator, but I realized in retrospect, that was kind of silly. So um, here, like for example, I'm using lazy loading so that if I have a feature that doesn't need to use some particular IO device, or in this case, we're talking about use cases that use IO devices, reminder API, reminder repository. Uh, here I'm using a lazy, um, what do they call that in Kotlin? Uh, delegates, um, lazy by delegate or some bullshit like that. I don't remember the technical name, but we're avoiding loading these things unless we need to. But in any case, the point of this is that um, a service locator, it's just some, in my my understanding of it anyways, please correct me if I'm wrong, it's just a class that holds on to dependencies. Um, whereas, so that's hopefully the implementation there. Whereas um, dependency injection comes in three flavors, I believe. I can't even remember what the third one is, but we have constructor, constructor, I can't type <laughs> injection. So that's just a fancy word of uh, constructor arguments. That's all that is. Um, there's field injection. So you would use like at inject if you were using dagger on a field. So something like, uh, yeah, we would have an annotation here is usually how we do it, at inject, blah, blah, blah. So now we're not actually using the constructor, but we're uh, having a framework to deal with it. And then um, I've, I'm quite sure there's a third kind. I, I thought there was a third one, but I can't remember off the top of my head what it was. So anyways, uh, method injection. Thank you, Florian. So yeah, there's injection as function arguments. So no matter what we're doing here, we are applying dependency injection. Anyways, um, so this is how I would look at it from a, a depend. Now, we can pass a service locator. Here's the thing. We can pass a service locator as an argument. So we can do both at the same time, basically. Hopefully that makes sense.